Good evening, hello and welcome. You're watching CNN News 18. This is Nation at 5 with me, Poonam Burde. And we have big breaking news that's coming in from down south. The AIA DMK has decided to walk out of the NDA, walk out of the alliance with the BJP. This is coming in just months ahead of the 2024 elections. It was a unanimous decision that has been passed by the AIA DMK. A meeting of the office bearers uh, was chaired by the General Secretary, uh, Mr. Palani Sami, just a short while ago, out of which a unanimous decision has been taken to walk out of the alliance to sever ties with the BJP ahead of the 2024 Lok Sabha elections. Purnima, my colleague now joining us, getting us more details. Purnima, we're learning right outside the AIA DMK office now. Our celebrations have broken out. It was a unanimous decision. But what exactly are the reasons that have been cited by the AIA DMK for severing ties with the BJP? Well, uh, this is not the first time that uh, the ADMK has, in fact, uh, uh, spoken about how uh, they are not okay with uh, the state uh, BJP president, Anna Malay. In fact, last week, the ADMK already said that currently they are not in an alliance with uh, uh, the BJP and only the ADMK will decide who its alliance partners would be in the run-up to 2024 elections. And today, the ADMK held a meeting uh, and all the MLAs and MPs, uh, in fact, were present. And in that meeting, the ADMK decided... Uh, to, uh, uh, to in fact, cut ties with the BJP, considering that the statements that have been made by the state uh, uh, BJP leader Anna Malai against Jayalalita, against CN Anna Dura in the in the in the latest uh, in, in in the last uh, uh, in the last couple of months, and therefore this hasn't gone down well. They in fact say that uh, they will uh, rather go alone rather than go with an alliance uh, with. Anna Malay as a state president, they are not okay with that. Therefore, they have uh, they've unanimously decided to cut ties with the BJP. That's the latest that we are getting. This was announced in the press conference uh, by uh, the AI India a short while ago. Right, now there were several back-channel talks that were happening uh, with the AIA DMK by the national leadership of the BJP as well uh, in the run-up uh, to this decision. Uh, there were several uh, uh, concerns that were raised by the AIA DMK Purnima, isn't it, with the central leadership of the BJP as well? Because they have been very clear that we do not want to deal with Mr. Anamalai. We will deal directly with uh, the national leadership of the BJP. And it seems like uh, the TN BJP chief was perhaps the only sticking point between the two parties. And considering there was no movement on uh, his removal or his reinstatement, the AIA DMK has decided to move on. Absolutely. They have always had a problem with uh, the state president, Anna Malai. In fact, what the uh, argument to understand is that uh, earlier last week, uh, the ADMK uh, met... Uh,